In this video, we're going to rebuild and refresh the carbs. If you like what you see, please be sure to subscribe for more. I'm Jish, and welcome back to the channel. So the first thing you want to do with any job like this is take as many photos as possible because after a few days you can soon easily forget where everything goes. The more photos you've got, the more reference points you can go by. With these carbs everything actually looked alright, no cracked rubbers, no gunky mess, just a little bit of nasty powder coat on the float bowls and the tops, but other than that, these just need a really good clean. So the way I'm cleaning these today is with my ultrasonic cleaner. This machine works wonders for small parts and things like carbs. If you don't have one in your shop I'd recommend looking and getting one. But before we go any further into today's video, I'd like to say thank you to today's sponsor, Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community where millions of creatives come together to start their creative journey with thousands of inspiring courses for curious and creative people, even basic mechanics for helping along with these builds. And right now I'm testing out one of Ali Abdul's classes to help my editing in Final Cut Pro. These classes are made by real people offering real ways of learning. And right now, the first thousand of my subscribers to click the link down below will get a one month free trial of Skillshare for you to try out. So thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back to the build. After 20, 25 minutes I've pulled them out and they already look better. All the nuts and bolts look shiny, everything looks great, so let's start putting them back together. As mentioned earlier, the float bowls and the CV tops all looked a bit nasty, so we're going to acid strip them, get them stripped down, and then we can repaint them.
so that is the carbs completely rebuilt they look so much better don't get me wrong they weren't absolutely filthy like some carbs can be but with a little bit of elbow grease and the ultrasonic cleaner it plowed through all the grime and dirt that was inside these but overall i am really happy with the outcome of these i can't wait to get them balanced and put on the bike that'll be in another video to come but if you enjoyed this video please leave a like leave a comment down below and i shall see you in the next video Shout out to all my Patreons out there. Thank you for supporting. It really helps the channel grow.